This is seven-year-old Henry Rivera. He was born deaf, but on Monday, something amazing happened. What Henry would normally see as just this became this. Henry made sure everyone in the room knew he could hear Dr. Tina Sheehan's hand smacking the table and that not every noise was welcomed. <laughs> Henry came to America and received his life-changing operation after Aaron Van Ord of Grand Rapids, Michigan met him on a mission trip to Guatemala. Aaron's next mission became giving Henry the gift of hearing. So there's something special about him from the beginning. And I started talking to him, but he couldn't hear me, and I knew my Spanish wasn't that bad, so I started asking around, and, and they said, well, he hasn't heard since he was little, but no one had known why. They hadn't done any tests, so I was like, okay, we need to figure this out, and that's when we started the whole process. Aaron received help to get the process started from Ray of Hope Medical Missions, a not-for-profit group in Fort Wayne. A couple of the local doctors here had, um, have worked with Ray of Hope and they had contacted me and I had one phone call with Aaron and I was on board. The $40,000 equipment was donated by Advanced Bionics and the procedure was performed by Dr. Disher at Lutheran Hospital. Little Henry heard his family for the first time, his family in tears at the news. Is it the very content and that? She's like about ready to ball her eyes out, but basically. <laughs> Henry has at least several more months in America as he works on his speech and learns to understand what he hears. The journey may not be over, but Aaron couldn't be happier with where it was today. I had like a flashback to that first time I met him when he couldn't hear me, and he could this time, so it was just everything we've done the past three years came flooding back, and it was all worth it.